My name is Jim Houts. I'm president of Molecular Imaging Products Company in Bend, Oregon. I'd like to demonstrate the 10-second test to you. The 10-second test is probably the single most important test that the user of the anesthesia device can do before you have the animal hooked up on the anesthesia machine. It will tell you if you have leaks in the system, it will tell you if you have the proper appliance hooked up to deliver the inhalant anesthetic, whether it's the rebreathing system or the non-rebreathing system. And you can also uh, make sure that the gases have a patent way out of the anesthesia device towards the waste anesthetic gas management system. Each one of you can receive one of these 10 second test cards to hang on your anesthesia device simply by giving molecular imaging products a call on our 800 number. 10 second test is this. Put your thumb over the end of the white piece, close the pressure relief valve on the rebreathing system, use the O2 flush to fill up the bag and put approximately 30 to 40 centimeters of water pressure into the system. Please understand we do not want you to put this much pressure when an animal is on the anesthesia system. We're just putting this amount of pressure in the system to stress it so that we can find out if we have any leaks. If the needle drops, the faster that needle drops on the manometer, the larger the leak that you have, and you'll need to trace it down and fix it before you can proceed on with anesthetizing an animal. The second part of the test is just as important as the first, and that is, with your thumb still over the end of the white piece, open the pressure relief valve, squeeze the bag, and make sure the gases have a patent way out of this system towards the waste anesthetic gas management system.